Now the next step is the verification and interpretation of the analysis results. So first of all, we'll create a load combination. So it will it's a linear load combination. So I will call it linear uh, LCB one load combination one. Um, for the load case, enter the three uh, load cases and click on close to create the load combination. Now we'll check um, the we'll check the deformation shape of our peel. So uh, go in the deformation here, tab, and click on display contour. Now in the load case, choose the load um, I just created, so the load combination one. Confirm that you are seeing the DX, Y, Z uh, components. Now you can check the option contour, deform, and legend, and click on apply. And now you have a view of the displacement contour in your solid model. Now we'll check the stress. So uh, to check the stress in the solid element, you have to go in the stress tab here and you have solid stresses. So again, select the load combination one. Uh, verify that you're using the UCS, uh, the user coordinate system, average nodal, and choose the sigma p max for the component. Um, and we'll see the contour of the form in the legend. Now I'll just click on apply and you are able to see the stress uh, on your peer model. To see better, you can zoom using the dynamic zoom. You can uh, turn your model. And also an option which is quite fun is to uh, use the render view so you can activate it by clicking F6 uh, also. So you have a view of your peer in a uh, three dimension here and you can move as if uh, it was real. So if you have a bridge uh, like that, if you're modeling a bridge, you can sit in the real environment and it's quite uh, impressive. Now uh, uncheck this render view and what I will do is uh, to show you how to create a, a cutting plane. So you have the option right here, cutting plane. But to use this option you have first to create your uh, plane. So you have to go in the structure tab and uh, here in the UCS plan you have the named plan option. So uh, enter a name for your plane. So it will just be plane one, for example, uh, X, Z plane. Enter the position, so uh, minus four meter. And uh, you can confirm the tolerance. Click on add. And now you see on the screen, uh, my plane is here. Close. Now you can come back in the result window. Uh, solid stress and check the option uh, cutting plane. Now you just have to check this plane one and click on apply to um, view this cutting plane. A good thing about the cutting planes is that you can uh, view several cutting planes at the same time. So you can check again and apply. And um, you have better view of uh, what is going inside your peer uh, model. Now finally, we'll check the results of the local direction for some at one position of the peer. 
So we'll close this window, 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 close this this window, as 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 this this window, as 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 as this window, 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 as this